The family of a Navy veteran is speaking out after he died while being restrained by police. 30-year-old Angelo Quinto was undergoing a mental health episode when police officers kneeled on the back of his neck for nearly five minutes to subdue him. He lost consciousness and died three days later. Quinto's mother says her son suffers from depression and called police for help. When police arrived, she says that her son was calm, but that police then grabbed him and threw him to the ground. He says, please don't kill me, at least twice. Ultimately, the George Floyd hole was placed on the back of his neck, cut off his breathing apparatus, and he was uh, a comatose within a matter of minutes. It didn't make sense to use that level of force and, and restraint on somebody who was not violent. The family does intend to file a wrongful death lawsuit against the Antioch Police Department. Authorities have not released a cause of death just yet. The family is having an independent autopsy conducted.